Hey, what's up, Steve? This is Devin Norton from SEO Dallas, Texas. Thank you for talking to me earlier and thank you for clicking on this video. I'm going to briefly show you how to beat your competition so you can start bringing in the customers that they're taking from you right now. If you're wondering why I'm doing this video, it's simple. There's a lot of small business owners out there that I recognize just don't have time to learn how to make the internet work for them and bring in more customers. And the only thing holding them back from hiring a marketing agency is that they don't know who is an expert and who isn't. So I found that when I make these attack plans and I give them away for free, there's still a lot of business owners who end up calling me back saying, you know what, Devin, I like you, just do all this for me. So if at the end of this all you see I've got some tricks on my sleeve and I can do some real good for your business, you can always give me a call and we can chat. And if you do want to take this information and apply it yourself, that would be great as well. I'm just here to help as many business owners as I can. Just please send me back some feedback and let me know that you thought this, this uh, video was valuable. I'm going to show you really quickly content, backlinks, and citations. Now, I didn't see your website up here, but also I found you on Craigslist, so I don't know what your website is, but I do know that you're a modeler in Midland, and so that's why I picked uh, Greg White Construction. These guys are ranking number one for remodeling Midland TX. So when it comes to a ranking a website, Google breaks down websites into a text file, and they send their robots through it to look for keywords, and keywords are phrases that people search into Google. So like remodeling Midland TX is one of the bigger ones. Now what Google's goal is, is they want to put their consumers in front of the website that's going to answer all their questions. So first you want to have that keyword multiple times throughout the text, but then you also want to have more content than your competitors. Now the average website on the front page of Google right now has 1,890 words, so you're probably going to want to be sitting about 1,500 to 2,000. And if you look at these guys, they probably are sitting about 500 on their page. So 1,500 is going to blow them out of the water. One last little quick tip on that is whatever your images are saved as does count as content. And so as you see, they have about column 300 by 300. No one's really searching for that, I don't think. Same with this one, work column. So you're gonna wanna save your images as like remodeling Midland TX, uh, Midland contractors, stuff like that, okay? So that's how you beat them with content and that's how Google considers you an authority on the topic. But they don't just wanna see authority, they also wanna make sure that you're trustworthy. And how they judge that is based off of how many other companies are linking to you, driving traffic to you. But they want to see relevant links. So you're going to get a lot more power from another construction company linking to you than you would from like pizza linking to you because Google knows you're not a pizza company. So the tool I use to check this out is called Ahrefs. It costs about a thousand bucks a month, but it gives you some really valuable data on what's going on in the back end of website. So you might want to use it to check out your competitors. But it's showing that Greg White Construction only has five websites linking to them. And they've only been around for three years. I don't know how long you've been around. but wouldn't be too hard to beat that. The biggest thing you're going to want to do is, again, get your content higher than theirs. But then to beat their referring domains, um, if they have five, I'd say go get 10 to 15 websites linking to you. And the best way to start is to copy them. So all these different websites I have are linking to them. You just go to those websites. There's usually like a contact us button or you can create an account and you'll get a link back to you. These are pretty powerful websites too. This domain rating is out of 100. So they're, going, they're pretty good websites. Um, and you can easily blow them out of the water with 10 to 15. And the big win is if you do beat them in content and you beat them in uh, referring domains or backlinks, then you end up taking all their traffic. As you see, Remodeling Midland TX has 30 people searching for that. General Contractors has 80 searching for that. Home Remodeling Midland TX has 20 searching for that. Contractors Midland, 60. So you can see this stuff adds up really quick and you want to target all these different keywords, okay? Last thing I'm going to talk to you about is when somebody does type in remodeling Midland TX and they're ready to buy, they call the first contractor that shows up that seems trustworthy and you want to be that contractor, those are the easiest customers to close. We already know people skip these ads all the time, whether it's from ad blockers or bad experiences, what have you, but where you want to rank yourself is the Google My Business section and getting here requires having more citations than your competitors, which is anywhere where your name, your address, and your phone number are listed in different directories across the web, like Yelp, Yex, Yellow Pages, White Pages, Facebook, Angie's List, Home Advisor, City Star. These are all the most common ones. The best strategy here is to figure out what directories your competitors are listed in, list yourself on those same ones, but then add a bunch more on top. So like if Leonard and Son is in 150 directories, you're going to want to put yourself in like 250, if not 300. So that's all I've got for you, Steve. I uh, tried finding you. I couldn't find your website. <laughs> that's all I've got for you, Steve. I hope you found this really informative. As a really quick recap, if you want to beat your competitors, you need to have more content than them. They only have about 500 words. I'd go and get 1,500. Uh, I'd go and get 10 to 15 websites linking to you. And then I would go put my name, address, and phone number in more directories in your competitors. Just make sure it's spelled the same way across the internet so Google links it all together. Steve, if you want to take this free information and apply it yourself, please do. This is absolutely free education. There's no uh, strings attached whatsoever. I'm trying to help as many small business owners as I can. COVID was hard on a lot of us. Uh, I just ask you, please send me back a sentence of feedback and let me know what you thought about this video, if you thought it was valuable. If you do want me to take care of this stuff for you, or at least give you some help, you can always email us back or give us a call. Our phone number is 214-441-6737. But either way, I'm very appreciative that you took the time to watch this video, and I hope you have a great day, Steve. Thank you. Bye.